everyone we are back with the second part of this huge gel nail polish haul if you guys missed part one definitely go and check that out gives you a little bit more context to this video and this is basically a continuation of some more gel nail polishes so now moving on to the actual nail polishes now like I said you guys I have so many there is no way I can show every single one of these in this video so what I'm gonna do I'm kind of going to group these by brand that I have at the moment I have so many different brands so I think I might do like three or four different brands and just show you all the colors I have from those specific brands. So the first brand I have is called Annie's. Now I'm not going to lie. I love the packaging of these nail polish bottles. These are just so gorgeous. They look so luxe too. And you guys would not believe the prices of these. I would say for these polishes, they ranged from, I would say two to $6 a polish. And these are some of the most like unique fun, beautiful colors I have ever tried. So I have quite a few of these. And unfortunately, some of these labels are all in Chinese, so I can't like read those obviously. And the specific one, I have this first one here. It does not have a number associated with it, but I do know the color. So I will put this one on screen. And I believe that this one is a magnetic gel polish. So this is what this color looks like. Next up, I have, this one is color number 10, number six, number 12, number three, number two, number seven, number 11, number five. I would recommend these if there are any colors that are really catching your eye. I'd say that these have some pretty unique colors. I just really like those. I like the packaging of them. They look so gorgeous and the polish is really beautiful too. This brand is called Vaki. It's V-O-K-Y. And I have a few different um, polish like styles. So there's some that come in like this pink chrome kind of packaging. Again, so, so cute. And then there are some that come in a white bottle with the gold chrome cap. So I have a few different colors here. So we're gonna start with the pink ones first. So we have number 11, number six, number eight, number two, number one, number five, and number three. Now moving on to the white bottles. These kind of have longer, like almost serial number. So for the sake of easiness of saying this and editing this, all of these colors start with V dash J Y J dash number. So I'm just going to say the numbers, but if you're looking for any of these polishes, they're all going to start with that V J Y J dashes. <laughs> So we have number 62, 64, 54, 72, and 67. So the next one, I only have three colors from this brand, but these are so pretty as well. Again, another really fun, like really luxe looking packaging of this one. It has like a really long handle. So number one, it makes it easier to hold on to. And this one is from the brand, ooh, I don't know how to pronounce this one. Please forgive me on the pronunciation on this one. It looks like it is initialed as QNL and it looks like the name is King Neng Long. This is the first one. This one is number three number one and number two this one again i only have three polishes of this one and this one is called vg or veg sister uh, i don't i don't know i don't know what that means so for this brand i have s02 s05 and S06. This one, I don't know if my product is mislabeled because this one looks completely different from the picture. In the picture, it looks like it is supposed to be like a champagne goldy kind of color, but this one is obviously a like coppery kind of orangey shimmer color. So I don't know if my product is mislabeled because I did go back and look, but for some reason, this color didn't look like what I expected, which was kind of funny because I actually have a color that looks so similar to this. And I feel like this is kind of a more unique kind of color. So it's funny that I have two colors that look exactly the same and they're very unique colors. All right, so moving right along into the next brand that I have, I have four polishes from this brand. This one is called Gary. It's G-A-I-R-R-I-Y. And again, these look really nice. I feel like they look really cute. I like some of the ones that have this more like custom looking bottle, whereas some of these are definitely a little more on the cheapy side, but that's totally fine with me because the price of these are absolutely amazing. This one is number 110, 111. This one is number 108. 
and this one is number 106. I also love that the bottles of these correspond kind of to the color, so that also makes it a lot easier to find what nail polish bottle I'm looking for, so I really appreciate the differences in the bottles themselves. Okay, so this next brand, it's another hard one for me to pronounce, so I'm gonna do my best, but I'll, I'll spell it first. So it's spelled X-E-I-J-A-Y-I, Zajayi, Zajayi, I don't know, I'm sorry you guys, but these are so cool because these are the cat's eyes one. So in the first video with the little nail swatches, I kind of teased those a little bit to show you guys some of the polishes. So these are the brand that those are from, and you do need a magnet with these to do like a a cool kind of cat eye effect on them but you can also get those from Shein I have some I forgot to show them in the first video but I have tons of those so I will try to link them below they can do all kinds of different like patterns and they're so fun I should do like a whole video just on that on its own because it really takes a like an interesting polish and then just makes it like so crazy cool so I do have quite a few of these we're gonna get through this first one is number zero three Number two, number one, number eight, number six, number five, number seven, and number four. This next one is another kind of cat eye one. This is actually from a different brand. Um, and it, this is the only one I have of this color. This brand is called Miss Cheering. And this one is in number three. All right, this next brand I have, I have a couple of these as well. This one is from the brand Rose About. So these are definitely a smaller nail polish bottle, but I don't mind that because these are so inexpensive. Like I said, I probably paid like a dollar or two for every one of these. So them being a little bit smaller doesn't really bother me because they are so cheap. So unfortunately these on the label themselves, unless it is just like in a language that I can't read, um, these did not have like a clearly marked number. So I ended up creating my own number system just so I could reference these from the swatch to the bottle. So these are the numbers that I created. I've got number seven, number five, number six, number one, number two, number four, and number three. So I will try to do my best to match these to the colors that I ordered and try to get those matched up as best as I can. So this first brand I have is called Meet Across. Again, these are another smaller bottle, but again, they're very affordable. So this first one I have is DT02, DT10, DT198, DT01, and this one is just number 37. These are actually in the same type of bottle, but this was from a brand, it's called MTSSII. The label on this one's kind of smeared, so it's hard to read, DC-103. This next one is another thermal, this one is DC-104. Another thermal, this is DC-102, DC-88, DC-80, DC-265, DB461, DC85, DC261, DC228, and finally DC266. Okay guys, so that is all that I have for today's video. Like I said, there will be a part three down the line, but I'm not filming that today. I could see myself doing this whole nail polish of the week series for like the next three years and I would be covered. So we've got a lot of polishes to cover. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. You can follow me on Instagram, link is below. And until my next video, I will talk to you guys later.